Hey, what's up everybody? This is Joshua Casper with Plugin Boutique, and today we're checking out the Sector Synth by Initial Audio, and this thing is cracking. It's really, really, really cool, and it, the sound it's coming out of this thing is blowing my mind, especially these sequences. So I'm gonna actually make it a little bit bigger just by clicking and dragging over here just so you guys can see it. Maybe even a little bit bigger. I really like that it's resizable. Um, so what I'm gonna do for this video is just run through some of these sequences and talk a little bit about what's available inside of the synth. This isn't gonna be a tutorial of any kind, but I just really want you to hear what's going on and how easy it is to get different things coming out of this thing. So it's a wavetable synth, essentially. However, you do have a sub oscillator and you do have the ability to load a samples right here. You can even load, you know, multi samples or, you know, your noises over here and things like that. So it's kind of similar to Serum in that regard. What's really, really cool about this is these sequences in the setting over here in this matrix. And I was just playing one, it's called Automata. <laughs> Right there, and that's called Automata, and I can change to different presets, uh, presets up here. But what's really cool is now that I've changed the, the main preset, it's changed all of the parameters and all of the routing and things of that nature. But what I can do now is save all of those sounds and just change the sequence pattern by using this navigation right here. So right off the bat, it's really simple to start generating cool ideas here because some of these sequences are just out of control. Okay, so that's sequences. Um, like I said before, here is the sub oscillator if we wanted to turn that on. Turn off the sample, uh, the, the sample if we wanted to. Right here are the wavetables and you got your different snapshots, but you can also come into the edit menu where you can really get into things and start moving things around. You've got two of those oscillators. You've got the oscillator plus section here where you can change the pitch, detune, stereo phase, level, and wavetable position over time for each one of the oscillators. You've got the sequence page, which we just talked about, the browser, and this thing comes stacked, stacked to the top with presets here, so many different presets. <laughs> Okay, uh, we've got effects here. We've got reverb, compressor, phaser, chorus, delay, panner, transgate, EQ, and distortion. They are all, all sleek and easy to use. Very straightforward stuff. You've got two different racks, so just, just so much goodness here. There's a settings page, and this is actually pretty cool because you can change the skin if you wanted to. See what I'm saying? It's very customizable. If you come into the GUI colors, you can actually come in and just change stuff. Also, we've got our main, oh, we got three macro knobs right here, which can be assigned to anything. And the way you assign things inside of Sector is just to click and drag. See the destination right here? You just click and drag. So if I want to go to the cutoff knob, boom. Now this LFO2 is sent to that cutoff knob. <laughs> Simple as that. Uh, so that brings me to the next point. We've got two different filters here. This is filter one. We do have a second filter, which again, we can automate and modulate, no problem. There is the envelope right here. And then down here, we've got the keys. We can view the keys, we can play the keys. We do have an expression section, and this is where you can you know, adjust how the synth reacts to different things, like your velocity, your pressure, the aftertouch, the modulation wheel, and the keyboard tracking. We do have ADSR 1 and 2, so attack, decay, sustain, and release. Destination, again, we can put this on the filters, we can put this on the oscillators, we can put it wherever we want. we got two of those. Modulation, envelope 1, 2, 3, LFO 1 and 2, 
and three and four, and then we have a modulation matrix right here. So the synth by itself is just blowing my mind. So let's just jump in and check out a few more of these presets. So I gotta come into the browser, let's come back into those sequences, and let's start from the bottom. I mean, these are all just so good. Let's check out some of the arpeggios. Bells. Synth strings, plucks, pads, miscellaneous effects, keys, leads, so much inside of this synth. So, I mean, I just wanted to briefly share with you some of the sounds this thing is putting out and talk a little bit about the synth itself. I'm probably going to be putting out a couple more tutorials with how to do a certain sound or how to use the sequence module itself. So if there's anything you want to see or anything you want to know more about, drop it in the comments below and I will try to get a video out for you. Anyway, I'm Joshua Casper for Plugin Boutique. This is Sector by Initial Audio, available now. Links in the description of this video. I hope you learned something. We'll see you next time. Thank you.